Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you how to install Ragnarok online on an OS X Macintosh. Uh, as you can see I'm running Snow Leopard which is 10.6.8. I'm running a, a 2010 iMac which is kinda old but not too old. Alright, so the first thing we need is this little thing called Wineskin Winery. I'll put the links in the description, so don't worry. Here is like the final product, Ragnarok Online, where I'm gonna show you how to install it. Okay, so uh, here we go. First, we wanna open Winery. We wanna install 1.6x because it's a more stable version. I wanna create a new blank wrapper. We wanna update everything, we're gonna get this and this. Then we go create new blank wrapper. We are gonna call it raw. Okay. And it's gonna go like this. It's gonna configure this. It's gonna ask you to install a few things. Then you just hit OK, OK, OK. And once it's done, it should go like. Give it a second. Okay, now I wanna view our wrapper in the finder. As you can see, here's my finished wrapper. Now we wanna show content package. Okay. Then we're gonna open wine skin. We are gonna go to advanced tools, wine tricks. It's going to take a while for this to load. Just give it a second. And a second now. Come on. <laughs> yeah, this, this takes a while because it has like everything you need all in one package. So don't worry. Well, this thing loads. I'm gonna show you how it looks like in the actual finished product. Oh, it's gonna look like this. You might want to enable this because some of the shortcuts involve Alt Q and Alt Q usually shuts down the the program you're using. Okay. This is taking so long. Okay. Hmm. Oh, there we go. And we go to games. And now in games, we're going to look for Ragnarok Online. Here it is, Ragnarok, Gravity 2000. We're gonna hit run, and we're gonna hit run here. Okay? Okay, run. Okay, this is gonna, as you can install the things, you just install them, and that's it. Okay? Now we just abort. I'm just gonna abort this because I already did it. And then after that, it's gonna ask you for this file. Give me a second. Uh, you go to your library. 
and you go to Cachines, and you go to Wine Tricks, and here in Ragnarok, you're gonna put the actual installer. You have to rename it to this because it's gonna ask you this name because it's the 2011 version. But you can download the latest uh, installer and then just rename it, and it would work that way. And then after that, you just have to to hit install, 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 and then there we go. After the installation, you kind of wanna. You want to reopen the wrapper. You want to go to Wineskin, Advanced. And then, for the executable program, you're going to go to Program Files, Gravity, Ragnarok Online. And you want to select Ragnarok X. Okay. And you hit Choose. It would open you. Then you hit Test Run. then it will open you this, the patch client. After everything has been completed, you just hit start. And it will pop up another window. And there we go, you just log in. And then we're off off to go, okay? For the icon, you just have to download... Excuse me? Oh. Yeah, cancel. For the icon looking so, so nice, you just have to download this, pick to icon, then you just download the actual icon, and then you just create this as an icon, then what you want to do is the next thing. Uh, open this in Finder. You're gonna go Command I, and you're gonna click this, and then you're gonna go uh, Command C, and then you wanna go to your wrapper. Let's do it in this blank wrapper. And you you just wanna click here and Command UV. Ta da! And then you have the icon, so it looks nice. Okay. Uh, so I hope. This was like helpful. The only thing you need is wine skin. You need the WS9 wine 1.6x wine skin 2.59. Create new blank wrapper. Then after that, you just need to download uh, the file. This file. This one that can be downloaded from the actual web page. Actually, right now Ragnarok is free to play, so you don't need to install like any other private servers unless you want. I tried installing Dreamer Raw, but it wouldn't work. The only server that has actually worked for me is the official server. And then after that, you just have to double click or click it here in your in your dock, and there we go. As, just let me show you it's fully functional. It has minor problems like if you let me show you. We got like just minor things. For example, if you're like here and you click here, you're gonna click like right here. So just avoid avoid clicking like next to the edge. Or if you click too high you're gonna click here. You just try avoiding that but outside of that it's pretty playable and as you can see it's running quite well it has no problems at all you can see people here you can you can chat then you can just move around <laughs> As you can see, there's no problem at all. So I guess I hope this this helped you. And if you are a Ragnarok Online player and you 
are on the Mac, now you know how to play Ragnarok Online. I enjoy your favorite game, which is mine. <laughs> Alright. Well, thanks for watching. And if, if there's any doubt, please leave it in the comments below and I'll answer them as soon as I can. Okay? Thank you. Bye-bye.